स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू प्रकाश सी बी एस सी टूडे वी विल सी एक्सरसाइज थर्टीन पॉइंट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव एंड सिक्स सो लेट्स गेट इन टू दैट क्यूबिकल बॉक्स हैज हेंच टेन सेंटीमीटर एंड अनदर क्यूबॉइडल बॉक्स इज ट्वेल्व पॉइंट सेंटीमीटर लॉन्ग टेन सेंटीमीटर वाइड एंड एट सेंटीमीटर हाइट ओके सो देर आर टू काइंड ऑफ बॉक्सेस वन इज अ क्यूब इट्स एच इज गिवन टेन सेंटीमीटर अनदर बॉक्स इज क्यूबॉइड शेप so its dimensions also given let us take here the given data first this is the cube and here let's take cuboid data so in cuboid edge is given 10 cm this a we are taking as the edge in cuboid long length is given 12.5 cm and breadth means wide is given 10 cm and height h is given 8 cm see in the first option what we have to find out here which box has the greater lateral surface area and by how much so we have to find out lateral surface area first then we have to tell which box has larger means greater surface area and how much it is let's find out first lateral surface area of cube and cuboid then we can see which is the greater one so lateral surface area surface area of cube lateral surface area of cube formula for a square so let's apply now 4 into a edge is 10 10 square so 10 square value 100 so 400 centimeter square is the lateral surface area of cube okay now let's find out lateral surface area of cuboid this is first option we are solving lateral surface area of cuboid lateral means four walls okay so formula 2h into L plus B. Now two into H height. How much? We have height eight into L twelve point five plus B ten. Then multiply sixteen. When you add, you will get twenty two point five. So multiply this. You will get. Uh, Three hundred and sixty centimeters square. Okay. Now compare this to which as the greater so lateral surface area cube only because this is four hundred. So therefore, by how much means you just subtract. This is lateral surface area of cuboid. So by how much means you just subtract four hundred minus three sixty. You will get forty. So therefore, cube has greater lateral surface area by how much? Forty centimeter square. So hope that you understand. Now let's go to the second option here. Now second option they are asking, which box has the smaller? Total surface area. Now we have to find out the total surface area for both the figures. Then we will see which one is the smaller and by how much. Let's find out first total surface area of cube. So total surface area of cube formula we know six a square. So six into a value ten square, six into hundred. So six hundred centimeter square is the total surface area of cube. Now let's find out the total surface area of cuboid. Total surface area of cuboid formula two into L B plus B H plus H L. Okay. Now apply all the values two into the length how much? Twelve point five into breadth.
that how much we have here 10 plus 10 into 8 plus 8 into 12.5 okay now simplify all this multiply all this and then finally add after that multiply with the two so finally you will get 610 centimeter square now you see which one is the smaller they are asking smaller is now how which one cube then how much difference so 610 minus 610 so therefore you can say cube only smaller so cube is so cube is smaller total surface area by how much smaller 10 centimeter square is smaller okay so let's get into the next question now question number six we have here a small indoor greenhouse herbarium is made entirely of glass pans including the base held together with a tape it is 30 centimeter long 25 centimeter wide and 25 centimeter height so it's given that length 30 centimeter and breadth means wide 25 centimeter and height also 25 centimeter so what is the first option we have to find out here what is the area of the glass so here's they said including the base then we have to use total surface area formula so total surface area of cuboid equal to formula 2 into lb plus bh plus hl now apply all the values 2 into l b plus bh plus hl so if you simplify you will get 4250 centimeter square is the total area of the glass now second option what we have to find out here see how much tape is needed for the 12 edges so for these edges they are going to stick the tape so how much length of the tape is needed then you see how many lengths are there first length one length 2 length 3 and length 4 so length we know 30 centimeter then four lengths are there so you can take then tape required equal to four lengths we have to stick because four lengths and four heights also is there one two three four so four heights plus now you see this is there where wide means width one two three four because all the edges they are sticking so that four into breadth we take four b now take four as a common outside then l plus h plus b now four into l how much 30 h 25 wide or breadth also 25 so simplify this you will get 300 and 20 centimeter so therefore how much tape is needed 320 centimeter of tape needed for 12 edges hope that you understand this thank you so much for watching next video we will see next questions thank you